do you defend a guy like Gronkowski like you would any other? Well, he, he's a, he's a good player. I mean, he's definitely one of their threats, so we got to make sure we know where he's on the field at all times and uh, like some of their other guys. So it's just, you know, like I said, we've faced some good tight ends the last couple of weeks, so it's um, it's very dissimilar to those type of things. Whoever their guy is that gets the ball, we got to know where he's at at all times. I mean, well, not, not giving away game plans or anything, mm -hmm. but, it, but does it help to kind of mix up the coverage on a guy like that to where you, you have sure. like a sure. man – at some point, maybe not local. At some point, yeah. I mean, yeah. I mean, you, you, you do a lot of different, you, a lot of different situations with matchups. Put a different guy on them, or yeah. whatever it may be. But uh, it, it's just like, like I said, it's like any other week. You know, we he, we know he's a good player. We know the quarterback's a good player. The backs are good players. They got good receivers. So we got we got to match up across the board, not just with him. As you scheme, do you see weaknesses in their O line where you can attack? No, I mean, obviously we look for it every week, regardless of what line we're playing, Tennessee, New England. But, you know, we just try to get our best guys on their worst guys, really, at the end of the day. That's really what this game is. You know, that's what every team tries to get their best guy on their worst guy on our team. So um, that's pretty much what we do every week. Where's Gino at right now, health-wise? He's think? doing good. He's progressing just like we thought he would be. You know, he's, he obviously was a little bit um, um, in training camp. It took him a little bit of time to come out of it, but he looks getting like he's getting back to normal now. There's obviously a big challenge on the field at 830, but when you play these, these especially these road games in prime time, yeah. how big of a challenge is it just passing the time during the day and getting off that regular Well, schedule? we've changed the schedule a little bit here to do that. You know, I, I don't know what the right answer is. I mean, like I said, I told I don't care that we're playing 830 or midnight at Fenway. I don't care. <laughs> we're going to play football, and this is a team we got to beat. Really, that's, that's the attitude I've taken with the players all the time.